Hey everyone, um, Justin here from 8 to 10. I wanted to do a video and show you guys um, a couple knife sheets that I made this weekend. Well, mainly this one really is what I wanted to show off. I've had a lot of people ask me if I do knife sheets, and I do. Um, however, majority of the time you're going to have to send me the knife uh, just because there's so many different knives, there's so many different styles, and it's impossible for me as a holster maker to keep up with all the different knives so what I plan to do though in the future is I'm going to start trying to purchase uh, some of the knives that I think are cool some of the tactical knives and th that's one of the reasons why I want to show you this video here so I have a knife here um, it's a Spartan blade it's made by Spartan knives um, I'm not sure exactly which uh, model this one is I think um, I'm not sure but I know you can uh, look at Spartan um, Spartan's website and uh, check them out uh, this blade here is um, it's a solid tang um, I mean or a full tang whatever uh, and it's S35 VN steel very nice steel um, I have a lot of blades with this uh, a lot of the new Microtechs are running S35 VN steel and so is Spartan and I think that's one of the reasons why uh, some of these blades are kind of ex on the expensive side this is not a cheap knife this is, runs about three hundred and fifty dollars uh, this is not my personal knife this is a customer's knife so but uh, they wanted an OD sheath um, so, so I made an OD uh, sheath for it very very nice sheath I mean this is uh, probably something that I'm very proud with I mean I'm you hear that click it's just smooth as butter I mean now just like with my TDI uh, sheaths I try my best now every knife is different but on this knife I was still able to get that full grip so I have a full grip it's it's gonna lay a full grip with that with that little notch there in the knife handle so when you pull it out you still you have that full grip so very very nice um, I, I'm really impressed with how this one came out as for the hardware on the back I did use OD green malice clips these are the malice clips I really like these I know so, uh, these things are super strong I mean it took me a, a few minutes to get these things unclipped because they're just that strong um, but what's nice about them is, is they're drilled the holes are drilled on three quarter uh, three quarter inch um, uh, spacing so and I did the sheath in three quarter inch spacing so what that allows the user to do is adjust the right height of the knife up or down um, and there's three holes so it gives you quite a bit of adjustability there so um, overall very happy with the knife um, let's get another let's hear that thing click in very smooth this thing is so sweet let's get a f look at the edge finish hopefully it's coming out let's see if that'll focus I'm using my phone here guys so bear with me okay I think it came out really well I hope the customer is really happy with this um, it definitely has a tactical look for if you're going for a tactical look I think I got that look down uh, for a knife maker I think I got the tactical look down if you're definitely wanting a tactical type knife sheath I would love to make you one um, however again I just ask that you're probably gonna have to send the knife to me and you can contact me at justin at 8to10.com and I'll have that information uh, on my website so you can send that to me if you want to contact me and we can discuss uh, your options but uh, I'm definitely interested in start doing more knife sheaths. I just haven't had a chance to do that many. I do holsters all the time, and it's just been one of those years. So I'm trying to expand and get into different things and do different things with the with the business. And um, knife sheaths seems to be pretty popular right now. So, anyways, hey, I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching.